Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Candace. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. On this video, I just wanted to kind of do a little chill video, just hang out with you guys, put on some makeup. I have not wanted to do my makeup for a while now, so I just decided to go ahead and use some of the products that I received last month, March 2020, in my boxes. I have not been trying anything on, so I thought we could just go ahead and do a little fun put my makeup on with me kind of video and um, see how you guys are doing. Um, hopefully everyone is doing really well. I know um, a lot of us are homebound for a little while here. I have not been motivated to do anything right now. Um, I have, this is what I just used, the Myriad. Um, this is the Hydrodynamic Eye Moisture. Um, I have not wanted to do my makeup. I have not wanted to do like anything. Um, but I just decided that today is a new day and I am going to get my act together and do my makeup and just try to feel better. I've, I've been feeling, um, a little bit like not scared, but, um, a little bit uneasy now with all of the coronavirus talk and all that. I'm just... I'm trying not to be um, too paranoid because that's not really a good place to be either. But um, I'm also just kind of in and just been a homebody, haven't really wanted to do much. Um, I didn't receive a foundation in any of my boxes, so I'm just going to go ahead and use the Estee Lauder Double Wear because this is one of my favorite go-to full coverage foundations. I have basically been home with my daughter and we have just been um, pretty much hanging out together and uh, playing Play-Doh and coloring and all that good stuff. So um, with that being said, I've been going a little bit um, stir crazy and so has my daughter because normally we are out and about every day and uh, we just don't sit at home like this. So where I'm at, there hasn't been a whole lot of sunshine or anything. Um, so we're kind of cooped up. But I'm a little bit rusty on my makeup, I can tell already, but that's okay. I just kind of um, wanted to mainly come and hang out with you guys. Um, what are you guys doing to keep yourself sane through all of this nonsense? Let me know in the comments below what you guys are doing to keep your head up because it can be a really scary time and a lot of people can get depressed, I'm sure. So I'm trying not to be... Um, too down but I'm also trying to be like super cautious and I could tell I have like a lot of like stress acne probably just from my like internal fear or worry um it's not good to worry but it's also um not good to just be oblivious so you need to kind of be cautious of what's going on um but today is gonna be a good day there's something about putting on your makeup and like feeling beautiful and just knowing that you look the best you can look and it just really helps to boost your mood, I think. I did receive a concealer in my BoxyCharm a couple of months ago. It's like the same color as my foundation, so I'm not even going to bother with that. I'm just going to go with... With this, I'm not really going anywhere, guys. This is just for me and you guys to hang out with me. So, next up, I'm going to use my Everyday Vacay Ciate London powder that I got. Not last month, actually, but the month before. So, I didn't get a powder this month, but I wanted to try this. A lot of the stuff I have not even tried because I've had nowhere to go. Have you guys ever tried these? This brand is Essence. I got this one at CVS for like three maybe four dollars but um this brand has really been good I like um I like their brushes I was not sure Ooh, this is the first time I'm trying this powder oh my goodness it smells like coconut which I love but it's like everywhere everywhere we're gonna have to tone that down a bit because that is so white oh my goodness oh crap Next, I'm going to use my Girl Powder Auto Balm. Let's see if we can tone down some of this really, really white powder. And 
always go down on your neck just to blend everything in so that you don't look like two different colors. Especially you guys saw like how drastic that powder was. So that was the bronzer. I actually don't think it's too bad. What do you guys think? Is that okay? And then I'm going to go in with the Zoeva blush palette. And there's actually like sort of like a bronzy shade in the middle, which I want to try. And then I'm going to try probably, you know what, I'll see how this bronzy gold shade um, goes because it has like a lot of shimmers. See, I know highlights are awesome right now, but I'm not like really a fan. I think I will go in and try this uh, Fame and Fortune shade, even though it is kind of um, shimmery. Not bad, not bad. The next thing I'm gonna try to attempt is to do my eyebrows. I know I've told you guys in previous videos that they're not really my specialty, but I did get this um, Billion Dollar Brow Taupe Colored. This is like a pomade, I think. Yeah, brow pomade. Um, so we're going to give it a try today and see how it goes. Even though this is taupe, look at how dark. It's like so dark. Eek. Okay, let's see what we can do here. We can get this to look decent. The hardest part for me is to get my brows to look like sisters. So let's see if we got this one. Okay, you know what? I don't hate it. So now we want to try to get a little sister action. But I can tell like with this pomade, it you have to have a light hand. You can't just be going all crazy because this is taupe and it's like dark. I have like close neighbors as eyebrows today, so that's pretty cool. Hmm. Okay, I'm not mad at that. All right, cool. Next thing I am going to try is going to be my Hello Charmer palette. I just washed all my eye brushes, so I have like a bunch of um, clean eye makeup brushes. So this is like awesome. Um, normally in between I just use my color switch and just go to the next color, but I have clean brushes, so When you're bored you clean your brushes and then you don't use them right because <laughs> you have nowhere to go Let me just lay a Base color down. I'm just gonna go ahead and go with this like yellowy um, Premium shade Let's see how it is. I have not tried these. I have not even Why is there traffic? There's nowhere for these people to go. <sighs> Everything is closed. I don't know. Cup of Joe. I'm going to do a cup of Joe. This little transitional shade here. Oh yeah, you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you like my videos. I enjoy hanging out with you guys and it just thrills me that you guys like my channel and subscribe. It's, for me, it brings a lot of joy. Um, that's really why I wanted to pop on here because I do find a lot of joy in this. And this is kind of like my happy place. What's your guys' happy place? Let me know in the comment. Like, what's your happy place? If you could pick something to do or somewhere to go, like, what would you do? Where would you go? What's your happy thing? This is turning out to be quite yellow. I'm not liking this so far. So let's go ahead and do um, some brown. This is an exclusive shade. I almost wish this was going to be a little bit darker. We'll see how this looks. Okay, this is like a glittery one. So what I'm going to do is actually use my fingers and see if that will help. So when I use my fingers, I just go ever so slightly, ever so gently. And now we're getting a ton of color payoff. So I'm glad I use my fingers. Brushes are good, but sometimes you just need to 
use your fingers. If you use your ring finger, it gives a lot less pressure. You're not like rubbing into your eye. You have more control. It will be a little bit softer and you can just kind of blend easier. So if you're going to go ahead and use your finger, use your ring finger. So I like the way that this is applying with my fingers better than a brush. So just a note to you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and use the pop-up shade, which is another shimmery kind of color. So we'll just go ahead and use the fingers. And this is just gonna be a really shimmery look. I don't mind that. I could use some sparkles in my life. Are you guys more sparkle people or matte people? I usually go for a really matte foundation and I don't do a lot of highlighters, but my eyes, like, I could do some sparkles on my eyes. Mm -hmm. So I want to dip into this pink one, this pink shade. This is Swipe Up. <gasps> fun! Oh, <gasps> This is so fun! Okay, yeah. This one will definitely make your day. Oh, I like it. I like it. It's so shimmery cute. Oh, it's so glittery fun. Yes. Okay, let's see. Next, I'm going to do my eyeliner. So I got the Urban Decay eyeliner in my Allure Beauty Box and I broke the tip. So my mother-in-law saved the day and brought me a pencil sharpener. Hmm, cute. It did go on really smooth and it actually took a lot less time than if I used like a felt tip because like I always am afraid I'm gonna mess up or it's gonna go all haywire. So I'm gonna try this um Rodale Mascara. Now, I have not tried it yet, but I know I mentioned in my video when I did receive it that I thought it had a smell, like a very chemical smell. You know what? I'm not going to be able to use this. I can tell. Like, So the mascara that I went to get is this Tarte Mascara. I got it not in March, but February in my Allure Beauty Box. It is so good. I love it so much. I really like the Tarte products because they're a lot more natural. And they don't use as much like harsh ingredients. And I can tell because my eyes don't itch or burn after I use them. So I really enjoy the Tarte products. Do you guys have a favorite mascara? I'm pretty sure that this is my all-time favorite mascara. This is my first time trying it, and I will definitely buy this again because I love it. <gasps> Ooh, I'm loving this. Let me get my bangs down. Oh my gosh, I have not felt this alive in a long time. So I have a lip gloss, the floss. I think that will be cute. Mm-hmm. Did I come alive? You guys saw me at the beginning without any makeup. That's like, that's crazy. I'm really hoping that this is going to be a good day. I need some good vibes. I'm sending you good vibes. I'm actually really liking this look. I don't know if I like it because I haven't had makeup on in uh, quite some time now or if I really like it. So I think I just really like it. It's a neutral look. It's like kind of like my normal everyday look, but I feel so much confidence already. I took a shower. I did my hair. I did my makeup. Like, what can go wrong? Oh, and I have my Gilmore Girl shirt on. This is a start of a good day. <laughs> I am so glad you guys are hanging out with me. I had a blast and I hope you did too. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. It would mean so much to me if you would go ahead and do that for me. Until we meet again, you guys. Ciao, Bella. Thank you.